Why do you think it has gone so well? I think um, there's so many children, adults out there who have got disabilities that is undiagnosed that yeah. is giving them food for thought, thinking, right, OK, there's something yeah. wrong with me as an adult or something wrong with my child. And we've had so much support and emails and everything yeah. off loads of people. And yeah. you yourself, you're just a different yeah, person, yeah. aren't you? It's like this huge weight off his shoulders. Mm. What changes but, have you seen in Tom, then? Oh, he's much more relaxed. He's, mm. he's, he doesn't seem on edge anymore. Do you think like it's because he... he doesn't feel like he has to... That's what we're talking about, like, you're not here. That's what happens when you bring your mum yeah, no. It's easier for us. It makes yeah. it easier for us because we haven't. It has been a roller coaster yeah. of, of, of since Tom has yeah, yeah. been growing up, and yeah. now instead of walking on eggshells, Stop. we can just walk on sand. It's oh, just that's a lovely uh, description. Yeah. Well, Tom, are we right in thinking that you have moved out um, of home? I will be in two weeks. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so, what, you're going to move in with your brother, aren't you? Uh, no, with uh, one of my mates from With Rugby. one of your mates. Yeah. How do you feel about that, Elaine? <sighs> it's going to be really strange, because <laughs> uh, it's been without a child in the house for 26 years. So got the old man, have to, and still got You're going to have to start talking to your husband. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Have you moved out so that you can uh, so that you can date more easily? You could be trying to find out. Have you got anyone yet? Have you got a girlfriend? Uh, yet? No, not yet. Oh. And, uh, I've been quite busy to be honest. We flat oh. out or anything, but uh -huh. yeah. yeah. Have you been, have you been getting lots of offers there? I've been on one or two dates. Oh, uh, have you? Uh, yeah. 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 How did they go? Uh, not too bad, all right. <laughs> One of the symptoms <laughs> of your Asperger's, I know, is um, trouble showing emotion, isn't it? Yeah, I, so I, that, that must be tricky with new relationships. Yeah, I find it hard to express and show my emotions. So, and it's quite difficult then if you're, you're going to meet a girl and you're going to tell her they, they think they're doing something wrong. And yeah. it's obviously hard for them as well. Mm. So, you know, it's, it's, a, it's a long process it's a to learn. It's a big learning curve to find out about you. But if yeah. you meet the, the right girl who, you know, we were all 100% behind you, Tom, because mm. there is somebody out there for Absolutely. you who is yeah. kind and caring and, and gorgeous on the inside as well as out, oh, yeah. that will come yeah. naturally yeah, in terms yeah. of her understanding oh, yeah. of that. Yeah. Yeah. How, how, about sharing your, how about sharing <laughs> your emotions with your mum? How are you with that? <laughs> I don't... Uh, I'm not, 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 you know if I'm hiding something, don't yeah, you? Yeah, well, I know straight away. <laughs> 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 um, I'd be, like, grumpy and moody, wouldn't I? Yeah. Then you know. He won't tell it to my face. He puts it on social media. If, if, he's, um, <laughs> if he's really uh, at a go, not a go with me, or if he's yeah. hiding something, he'll just thank me on social media because oh. he can't say it oh. to is, me. Is, is that something that you would really... Like him, be able to, to to be able to do to express how he feels towards you. I would you. say yes, but I know that isn't Tom, so I wouldn't yeah. want to put any pressure on him to be like what that. What was that like because... when he was growing up then? When it, because it, for, he was undiagnosed, weren't you? You were undiagnosed yeah. till twenty-one. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. With all the you know, oh, was, um, fifteen and then twenty-one. It, it was, was a nightmare. It was a dark place. Right? Very was, uh, as a, a as a family. Right. We kept it all within the, the walk yeah, the four walls. Yeah. I yeah. mean. Close family, you'd mm. tell them so much, but what went on behind closed doors it was. Because people just think you're naughty, be. don't they? Oh. Yeah. And, but when you got that so, diagnosis, it must be such a relief. It was it like, was a, OK, yeah. this is what it is. It was a relief, for, was you, a relief for me, but not for Tom. In, because I was, in, I was embarrassed, it was. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Initially. Yeah, I just yeah. wanted to be normal and be like my yeah. friends. Yeah. And like, mm. But, like, you know, I'm you know, mature and normal. Yeah. But I've accepted And I hope what you've seen now is that there is no such thing as normal. We're all different in our own in our own ways. They try to make out that we are the neurotypical ones and yeah. Tom, people like Tom aren't, but I think yeah. it could be the other way around. <laughs> and, and, <we're, laughs> and also, Tom and I have been having a wee chat and um, I know that you, you've said that it's not necessarily easy for, for Tom mm. to express himself, so he wrote a few words down. Right. And uh, you're going to read these out now, aren't you? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, like, dear Mum, like, thank you for putting up with me all over the years. I know I haven't made it easy for you and we've been through some dark places and dark times. And, like, I always find it hard to show my emotions towards you, but today I want to tell you deep down how much I love you. And, uh
It's like, um, there's, there's no love like uh, mother's love, is it? And, uh, mm. you know, you're like a lioness looking after their cubs, <laughs> isn't it? So, mm. And, like, the most I want to thank you all as well. I remember when I broke my leg, when I snapped my femur, mm. and I was uh, on the sofa for six weeks, so I couldn't train, get out and uh, go to the gym or nothing, and I was in a very dark place then. And, uh, you know, you got me through, through that. Yeah. And I come out, you know, stronger on the other end. So I don't really thank you for that properly yet, but... I'm thanking you now. Oh, thank and, you so uh, you know, <laughs> you know, yeah. 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 And I, like, I know you're there for me 24-7, but, I, you know, I'm there for you as well. Yeah, I know. And, like, and like Matthew is as well, my brother. Yeah. And, you know, you know, I'll never take you for granted. You know, I'm you know, lucky to have the support and the family around me. And, mm. like, there's always more people worse off than yourself somewhere. There is, and so that's what got, I've always I've got to, Yeah, you've got to be grateful, and uh, yeah. I here am, and, like, mm. you know, so uh, I do love you so much, so happy mm. Mother's Day. Thank you. Thank you. For more Loose Women action, click here. And I'd subscribe if I were you. It's totally free and it means you'll be kept up to date with new videos and exclusive YouTube content. But me and PE was the nightmare. Oh. I'd be like, I'd be hanging on the bottom of that rope. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely sure there was no way I was going to even be. And then I'd be looking at the horse and thinking, there's no way I'm going to get